Hey guys, what's up? Um, this is Liberates, and today we're gonna be, um, well, I'm gonna be, I'm gonna be doing another tutorial, and this one will be in Sony Vegas, and, um, first of all, I'd like to apologize for the lack of tutorials. Um, I've had a lot of, uh, work to do in school, uh, I have finals coming up, and I just, I've just been, you know, school stuff, but, um, um, so yeah, um, these tutorials take longer than you guys may think, um, a good tutorial for me may take around three tries, and if tutorials are like ten minutes long, then, you know, that's kind of a long time, and then the rendering time and stuff, so, I'll just get started, this one shouldn't be too long, so, um, I'm gonna try and get more in eventually, but for now I'll just, I'll, I'll make this one real quick. So, um, first of all, this is gonna be a color emphasis tutorial, so first of all, what we wanna do is you wanna drag in your, um, your clip and um i'm just gonna hold on i'm just gonna put on my normal my normal settings oh wrong one okay that didn't work so we'll take that one off um uh, all right i'll just add a little bit of color correction to it make it look a little nicer bring out some more colors and we'll sharpen it. Okay, now um, what we want to do from here is, um, so you want to find the color you want to stick out. Uh, I want to make the camo of my gun stick out because it would just look really nice. So basically you want to get to a good part where that color is showing. And then you want to go over to, uh, go up and then you want to come down and select color corrector secondary. Click on that. And then you're going to click on this preset, reset to none and you're gonna drag it onto the clip. Now what you wanna do is you wanna come to this where it says select effect range. You wanna click on this little eyedrop tool and you just wanna basically click the color that you want to show. Uh, so just click on that and then once you're done with that you're gonna take the saturation and you're gonna drag it all the way down. Now you're gonna come down here and you're gonna uncheck or you're gonna check invert mask now you can see it's kind of showing but not really so you're gonna take the limit luminance make sure it's checked bring the low down to zero and bring the high all the way up now what you want to do from there is go over to limit saturation bring the low down to zero and bring the high all the way up and now you can see it's showing pretty good and the blood showing on the screen and so is the um, color of the enemy team but everything else is black and white but <clears throat> you can still see com some colors like these up here are kind of showing and down there a little bit so you're gonna come to I'm gonna smooth it up a little bit and that should take care of the problem but if it doesn't see I still have orange down there then you're gonna wanna come to um, center down here and you're basically just wanna gonna toy with it until you get it the way you like it so um, let's go 110.8 um, alright, we'll try 112. Uh, okay, that looks pretty good. So now you also uh, can bring the smoothing all the way up on this one. And it will bas it basically just blends it, makes it look nicer. Um, so as you can see, if we go through this clip. Well, if it would stop lagging, that'd be cool. Um, hold on. I'll just go up here. Um, so you can see that basically anything in the um, hue of the color that you selected will be showing a little bit like right here this wall was kind of an orange color so you can see it kind of shows and you can see everything else is black and white um, my gun is showing really well and the red glove is kind of showing so yeah so that's that tutorial and I hope you guys enjoyed this I will show this clip again at the end and I'll see you all later um, look for more tutorials RCXD ready for launch.